from the Washington Street campus of Amarillo College, bringing you the news, events, and activities of your community college. It's the AC Report. Welcome to the AC Report. I'm America. And I'm Raz. With this quick look at what's happening this week at Amarillo College. AC hosts the first spring leadership retreat last weekend, and Christy Rankin has the story. About 50 students attended the leadership retreat and said it was a life-changing experience. The speaker, Ryan Pano, worked with the students and faculty over a series of exercises and activities. For me, when it comes to working with people, I always want to say, like, how can we get you in a place where we can really find out where you are, find out where you want to go, and, and get you to realize the person you are capable of stepping into to get there. And that really excites me. The, the, the challenge with doing that is that you have to bring a curriculum, a, a content, a process, a, an activity, a retreat that is physically, emotionally, and intellectually challenging. And that's what we do. And it's not meant to like scare anyone. It's meant to get us a little bit shaken, to get us a little bit out of our status quo, to take us out of a pattern of complacency that allows us to take the next step to where, where we're capable of. The, that's the goal of it. It's, it's not, to, not to break or hurt or anything. It's to say, we've got so much to give. Let's start tapping into that. English major Shelby Silvertooth says that she made friends who will continue to help her after the retreat. It was really cool. It was a great experience. It was really empowering and like everyone got found a really good support system for whenever we leave. I can't stress this enough. It's a great opportunity. Um, students, they overall, we've gotten so much closer. We've gotten closer to the staff. It's been a really um, awesome two days. Over the two days, there were a number of activities that involved trust, and the student had the opportunity to get actively involved. Secondary education major Alexis Tarango talks about her most dramatic experiences. I broke a freaking arrow with my throat. Uh, yeah, I cried for like an hour just now. I don't know. I, I think the most dramatic thing was I realized who I really am, and I realized that I am enough. The retreat will be held next spring along with the annual fall leadership retreat. This is Christy Rankin with the AC Report.